pretty, I, I, this is pretty stunning. As you know, early in the Trump administration, Donald Trump okayed a raid in Yemen where at least 11 children, I think it was, eight children were killed. We haven't heard much about that. One of them, I think, was Anwar Awlaki's daughter from reporting. Also, a Navy SEAL, Chief Petty Officer, I guess, died. A guy named um, <clears throat> Bill uh, Owens, Ryan Owens, I think it is. And Donald Trump, in, in an inability to accept responsibility for okaying this raid, which apparently I uh, saw reported today, has given no information. There's been, you know, you would anticipate them bragging about the, the key info they got. They got no info. For a while, they pretended like they were actually going after a top um, ISIS leader, I think it was, or Al-Qaeda leader. None of that turned out to be the case. But here, Donald Trump is on Fox and Friends now, blaming the generals for screwing up the mission. Mr. President, you mentioned John McCain mentioning uh, that uh, young man who died, the Navy SEAL who yes. died in that mission. Uh, his father has said that he didn't want to talk to you. Your reaction to that? Well, this was a mission that was started before I got here. This was something that was, uh, Pause it. you know. Now, it was not a mission that was started. There are multiple missions that they have at any given time or not, and it was consistently rejected by the Obama administration. It was, they have these missions on a shelf, essentially. So it wasn't started. It was just planned. Just like, oh, I guess, nuking probably a half a dozen countries around the world is also, there's plans somewhere if you want it. Continue. Your reaction to that? Well, this was a mission that was started before I got here. This was something that was, uh, you know, just they wanted to do. Uh, they came to see me. They explained what they wanted to do, the generals, who are very respected. My generals are the most respected that we've had in many decades, I, would, I believe. Uh, and they lost Ryan. And I was at the airport when... The casket came in, the body came in, and it was a very sad with the family, and it's a great family, incredible wife and children. I met most of the family. And I can understand people saying that. I'd feel, you know, I'd, pe I'd feel, what's worse? There's nothing worse. There's nothing worse. But again, this was something that they were looking at for a long time doing. And according to General Mattis, it was a very successful mission. They got tremendous amounts of information. There you go. Just even in that situation, unable to, to take any type of, and it's not even a question of like, it's just, just even the politics of it. Like, like to sit there and say, it was like, well, it was their deal. Yeah, but you know, the, I have to say, like, the things are so degraded that when I first heard this clip or watched it, I was genuinely surprised that he didn't attack the guy's dad. Right. I was like, oh, that was a pretty mild response. I mean, I, that was really my first place I went to. If he comes out again, I'll get him. If he yeah, comes out I mean, again. Look, everyone yeah, gets you a, get, you get one. Your kid you dies. You get one. You get, get, one. You get, you one. get a pass. You get one pass. You do again. Not two passes. There's going to be a counterattack. I really get JFK and the whole Bay of Pigs thing now. It wasn't his deal. Hey, it's Sam Cedar. Why don't you uh, subscribe to this channel? You can do so right, uh, right over here. Over. Subscri subscribe. Subscribe.